Okay, the sun was out. It was very sunny for us, but really not enough to warm things up for us. We have Robert back with us to get right into weather. And then also, Robert, you're trekking Santa for us. Yeah, we are. Uh, you know, if this uh, weather, sh it should get you in the Christmas spirit because it's certainly cold enough. It feels like Christmas. Now, you know, I want to show you something here after I get through our impact graphic, which we are making tomorrow an impact day for everybody, uh, basically because of those wind chills that will be cold yet again. Because we've got cold air over the region, it'll still be blustery at times, especially across northwest Arkansas. That's why we'll have those wind chills between 5 and 15 degrees tomorrow. Here's a look at high temperatures observed today. Many places stuck in the upper 20s like Bella Vista and Eureka Springs now. When you look at these numbers, this time last year, we had highs in the upper 60s and lower 70s. So what a difference a year makes in terms of our temperatures. 30 degrees cooler than at this point last year on Christmas Eve. So very, very chilly out there. And it's cold right now as we take a look at what the actual air temperature is. Everybody's fallen into the upper 20s. A few mid-20s right now. Huntsville, Salem Springs, Ozark, you're all down to a 25 right now. Winds are subsiding. They don't look that bad. And the gusts aren't that bad. However, at these temperatures, it doesn't take much of a wind to knock our wind chills down. And you can see just that very light breeze. We've got wind chills in the teens and lower 20s, and that is expected to continue to fall as we put this into motion here over the next uh, 12 hours or so. You can see that by 11 o'clock, many locations in Northwest Arkansas, upper teens, lower teens. By tomorrow morning, maybe if you're getting up early to maybe uh, open up some of those holiday gifts, single digits for those wind chills. Look at Huntsville, five degrees. And by 8 a.m., maybe when some of those little ones are getting up to run under the tree, still many locations, single digits and lower teens. River Valley, you're in the mid-teens for your wind chills. And again, wind chills are what it feels like to the exposed skin. So you want to try to cover up that exposed skin as much as possible. Wear gloves, a heavy jacket, uh, a hat if you have to go outside tomorrow morning. And by 8 o'clock tomorrow night, maybe you're finishing up that Christmas dinner temperature. Still, those wind chills in the 20s. All of this is because... We have a very vigorous storm system that is pressed well off to the east of us, but it's the flow around that system that is giving us all of those gusty winds and those cold temperatures, a full-on rain and snowstorm for our friends in the uh, northeast. Lows tonight will fall into the mid-teens across northwest Arkansas, lower 20s across the River Valley. We won't rebound very much tomorrow, only into the 40s. Most of the northwest Arkansas will remain in the 30s for a good part of Christmas Day. Here's your extended forecast. Again, a cold Christmas, and then we warm up pretty quickly into the upper 50s and lower 60s for this weekend, and then the next chance for rain rolls in here by the early part of next week. Maybe some of you are back to work, but I'm sure many people are off between uh, Christmas and the New Year's break. Here's a look at the River Valley. Look at those highs by the weekend, folks, into the 60s before our next chance for rain rolls in here for Tuesday and Wednesday. So all in all, a nice Christmas is shaping up, Jamie. Very good to know. We know Santa is on his way to town.